Okay, oh, yeah, so what's this? That is sodium hydroxide, glucose, and um, methylene blue indicator. Sodium hydroxide, glucose, methylene blue indicator. Undisturbed until it turns clear. So okay. it should sit there, hopefully, so, and turn clear. I'll stop disturbing it. So then add 10 to 20 drops of food coloring. Wow, this is like one minute later. Just put food coloring in there. You might have a, a, a yellow pumpkin. <laughs> but it's cool, dude. Like, it's super, super, super cool. I should like you guys. Oh. Now watch. Disappeared pumpkin. That'll take longer because of uh, how long it's been. Yeah. But you'll see how I get it. It's always like longer early because it's so concentrated. Mm. And then the more and more and more you go. Okay. Yeah, you can start to see it like lightening up now. So it's turning green. See that stain changing? Mm -hmm. See how it comes back? Yeah, it goes. He's semi orange. All right, cool. <laughs> so you have to wait a little bit of time until my man comes back from the dead. All right, just wait for it. It's slow. He's tired. It's two, it's, what is this, Wednesday? Yeah, Wednesday. So he's tired, it's Wednesday. So this is what's called the reappearing pumpkin. The actual uh, original experiment is from Princeton. Anybody know anything about Princeton? What are their colors? orange and black, okay? So this professor um, developed this experiment in what's called an oxidation reduction reaction, okay? So when I shake it, all right, I'm basically oxidizing everything. So the, see, now my pumpkin comes right back. So what's happening is, is all the, um, uh, basically sodium hydroxide, things like that are getting reduced, so it changes color. We have an indicator in here. And so then it changes color because I'm taking oxygen, oxygen out, okay? then the bubbles are like coming back in and they oxygenate it and give it oxygen back. So that's why you can re replicate this experiment over and over and over and over and over again, okay? And so the longer it goes, like the less like time it takes, things like that, but his original one is really cool because it was in a beaker and on a stirring plate and he put the drops in there and it would be black and then it would boom, immediately go to orange um, right away. So kind of a cool little experiment there. So. I would tell you to hold him, but this is completely round, so if it's round, it falls down. <laughs> so.